Hey guys, I am here to share with you, obviously, my Amazon haul. Now this is a lot of boxes, but they, several of these boxes only have one thing in it, the way that they ship them things out. So all of this stuff I purchased over the two prime days, what was it, the 21st and the 22nd, and I got the last item <laughs> delivered on Monday, and what was that, the 28th, and today is Tuesday. So, and I'll probably have dogs walking in and out because whenever I am at their level on the floor where they can easily reach me, they are around. So hopefully that's not too distracting for you guys, but I don't want to make them go hang out in the bedroom or anything like that. So for Amazon Prime, I basically first checked whenever I'm on Amazon or I'm like cleaning the house and I think of something that I would like to have, I go on Amazon and I just put it into my like later, what is it called? Save for later? area so what i did was i went on there to see if any of the items were on sale and several were so i just went ahead and gave myself a generous budget because i i was looking for a lot of things and i purchased anything that was on sale not a lot of these were like a significant sale but hey every little bit counts right so as i'm sharing with you guys each item i will pop up the original price i think i wrote all of those down and the price that i paid and then maybe like the stock photo as well so you guys can get a better Better look at what it is. Also, I got a variety of stuff. It is a little more like kitchen heavy because that's what we are in the process of redoing and I am purchasing some new things, replacing some items, that kind of thing. So a lot of kitchen stuff, but definitely a few things from other categories as well. So let me stop chatting. I'm just really excited to open these up because they've been sitting for a couple days waiting for everything to arrive. Let me go ahead and start opening everything up. We'll start with the bagged items and these are in no, obviously I didn't open um, anything or like organize it so it's all random all right first up i did get myself some new watch bands these are leather bands i got a black and a brown i had a light brown one but um we have been fostering puppies that like to chew and they uh, like chew it when it's on my wrist so it's got a lot of chew marks in it i tossed it and i wanted to replace it so i saw that these were on sale and i picked these ones up i got a bag for my husband then this is just a basic black duffel bag. It's not huge, but occasionally for work, he does go out of town and all the bags that I have are a little more on the feminine side. So I thought I would get him one that he um, could easily put like one or two outfits in, a couple back items, and he would be good to go and not have to take any of mine. All right, last bag here. This item actually, completely fell apart but this is a measuring cup set and i've had this on my list for a super long time i'm glad i brought scissors so i can cut some of this stuff up and i got these because they have cups that i don't have in the sets that i already own so these ones have one eighth which is not in any of the sets that i own i've got the one four it's got a one third a half, the two third, which is one that I don't own. And then it also has three quarter, which is one that I don't own. I will probably, yeah, I'll take this off. I don't like keeping them attached like this. And then it does have the one cup as well. So this brand is a Smithcraft. I don't think I own anything by them, but it's just those, the cups that I don't already own that I really wanted to have on hand. All right, so this is a box that I am not going to open, but I finally got myself a ring light. This has been, and you guys are gonna hear kids, sorry. It's just real life summer here. But this has been on my list forever. I don't know why I've not purchased one before because it's definitely gonna help out a lot, especially today's gloomy. That's why I'm filming in here because there might be a little bit of an echo. The ceilings are really tall, but it's the brightest space in my house. But now that I have this ring light, I'll be able to film in some other quieter areas. So I'm really excited about that. Okay, this item, I'm definitely gonna have to put up like a stock photo so you can see it better. But this one, we are going to be working on redoing our daughter Pearl's room. Um, she's got one of the smallest rooms in the house and she likes a lot of stuff. So it's been hard to kind of rearrange her room and we have been using her room. She's been bunking with her twin sister, Rose. We've been using her room while we were fostering um, a mom and her six puppies. 
So she, we were able to take everything out of her room and now we're just gonna use this as a clean slate and start decorating it more for like her preteen likes and dislikes and that kind of thing. So this, she and I saw, and I was like, that's so cool. It is a chair swing. However, I did make sure I had a talk with her and it's not like a swing, like an outdoor swing, more like a chair, like a hanging chair. So we are both really excited to get this in her room. Okay, now we'll start tackling the tower of boxes behind me. So in the first box, okay, good. These are a set, there's two in here. I really only need one, but I can easily um, figure out something else to put in the other one. We have two glass oil jars in our kitchen and one of them was dropped and it worked. It continued to work for a little while, but the piece of glass on the top chipped off and now there's another piece of glass missing so maybe it was dropped again but now every time we use it it leaks out the top so this is i'm only going to take one out but it is like i said a set of two so we've got that and then here is the top and then these will just be they just sit out on my counter near my stove top because this is what i use like in my pans to help with sticking it also came with a little funnel too which i thought was really cool to help refill it as well as an extra topper so it's got two bottles two tops and then an extra top and a little funnel actually i just pulled the other one out just to check and make sure it wasn't broken and it came with two extra tops which is really nice all right and then the other item within this box or that box is another thing that i picked up and i'll have to share the stock photo because you guys won't be able to see exactly what it looks like for my daughter Pearl. So she loves wearing jewelry. She's got her ears pierced. She just used some of her own money on Amazon, not on Prime Day, um, to buy a pack of rings. So she needs some jewelry systems in her room. And this is a pack of three shelves. It's like a white distressed wood. Can you guys hear me popping that? That's so satisfying. All right, get distracted, but it's a set of three, and then it does have, it's a shelf, and then it has different little jewelry um, things that kind of hang off of the bottom. So she'll be able to use the top for like any little perfume. She doesn't have a whole lot, but she can use it for like little makeup or perfumes or whatever, knickknacks, whatever she wants. And then the main thing was the jewelry. And I will definitely be sharing as we are um, organizing and putting new things in her room. I'll be sharing that over on my vlog channel, which is always linked in the description box. All right, next box. Okay, if you guys have an Instant Pot, I it comes with a ceiling ring, obviously. And a couple years ago, I did buy an extra ceiling ring, but even though you can clean it and get most of the smells out, every now and then you just need to replace those rings. So I saw that they had a set on sale and I went ahead and picked it up and there's three in here. And what I like to do, I'll go ahead and open this and take them out. Sorry if that is really loud. I know sometimes when you're opening packages on camera, it can be really loud. But I like that they are different colors because what I will do when I remember is I will use different rings for different types of dishes. So like savory, dessert, and then anything. I like to use the clear ones when I'm doing things like with just water because it's less likely that they'll stain. You know, like if I'm making rice or hard boiled eggs, that kind of thing. So again, I don't remember to change out my rings all the time, especially when I'm filming. I'm just in the moment, I'm trying to rush. But that is the general um, rule of thumb in my house for my Instant Pot is I use them for different things because then this one will start smelling savory and this one will start smelling sweet and it'll just be, I don't know, mixing them up, having the sweet with the savory. I don't know if it would affect your dish at all, but that's just my different way of thinking. All right, the other item or the only other item in this big box, like I said, there's, there's a lot of boxes here. I picked this up for my daughter Paige. Now, I think this video is going out, hold on, I'm gonna get a little lower. I think this video is going out on Wednesday and her birthday is on Friday and she's turning 17 and she loves coffee, but preferably 
cold coffee. So what she'll do is she'll just take a glass mug, fill it with ice, and then brew a cup of coffee in it and add her creamer or whatever she wants and she's good to go. Um, so I saw this and I was like, oh, that's really cool. She has a little spot in the refrigerator for like her own foods to make sure nobody else touches it. She likes a lot of vegetarian and vegan items. So I thought this was really cool. It has a little spout and I think it has three Oh, 12 makes 36, 12 bean bags in here. Oh, wow, I could have sworn I just read three, so that makes even more. So there's bags in here, I'm not gonna open it. And you just put the bag in here and then fill it with water and let it sit, and then you've got cold brew. So it says here four bean bags. Okay, so it makes three um, of these, but there's 12 bags in there. So four bean bags plus eight cups of water equals 12 servings of coffee concentrate. I thought that was really cool. Let's see, remove all beans from the pouch. I'll just share it with you guys on the back, but it's just Grady's Cold Brew Kit, New Orleans style iced coffee store and pour pouch, and includes our famous bean bags. It says natural, sugar-free, just add water, a bruise hot too. So if she wanted to use these bags for hot, but like I said, she prefers the cold ones. So I picked that up for her and I'm just gonna give this to her on her birthday. I did already just take my scissors and open them all just to make this a little faster. Yeah, there was only two things in this big box too. All right, so I got a couple things for my girls, Rose and Pearl. They are twins if you are new. They're eight years old, they're turning nine in November. So a couple of things I saved for their birthday and then a couple of things they'll get right now because I know that they would love to play with them over this summer. So I got them two different clothing sets for their dolls. They have the little 18 inch dolls, like um, my generation. What is it, Life? I don't remember the different names between Target and Walmart, but they have a couple different dolls. Eventually we will take them to the American Girl store. I used to take my oldest daughter there, but not the cafe hasn't been open and that's a huge part of going there. So I can't wait for the cafe to open back up so I can take the girls there. But anyway, I will pop up the stock photo so you can see. This is one of the sets. It comes in this little reusable bag if they wanted to store them in here, which I thought was really cool. And this, is, this one is the 21 piece. 18 inch doll clothes. It has some hair clips, hair bands, underwear in here. So again, I picked that up. I'll probably, I picked up two of these. You'll see the other one when I get to it, but one of them I'll give to them right now for the summer. And then the other one I will save for their birthday. All right, another kitchen thing. And I'm looking at this and I think, I don't know, I should have got the smaller size. So this is an air fryer silicone pot. So depending on what you're making in your air fryer, if it's something that's going to like make a lot of mess on the bottom, like go through the little grill grate that's in there, this will hold that, but it'll still cook perfectly fine in the air fryer. So I wanted to pick one of these up to give it a try and I opted for the extra large one. I think this will fit because I have a six quart air fryer. This one just, it just looks really big. So it says highest quality food grade silicone, air fryer silicone pot. The extra large size is 5.3 quart or bigger and the color red. They did have a, I think two smaller sizes depending on what size air fryer you have. All right, so that's another box down. I got some dog bones and I've already opened this. The second this box came in, I opened this up to see if my dogs would like them and they love them. So these are Blue Buffalo Dental Bones, cleans teeth and freshens breath. It is, or they are wheat free. There's eight large in here. It says daily bones for dogs 50 pounds and above. I have a full bred lab who is, I think she's 80 something pounds. And then I have a lab mix. I forget what he's mixed with. I always forget. We did that little DNA test. I want to say, not Collie because he's bigger, but he's 60 something pounds. So these are perfect for them. Like I said, I already gave them one each and they loved them. So I picked those up. I saw that they were on sale. All right, this I will probably have to, yeah, I'll pop up a stock photo. So these are head rest hooks. I am constantly, when I'm in my car driving, my purse, I just set it in the passenger seat and sometimes I take turns a little fast. I definitely err on the uh, get me there in a hurry 
and a not slow and steady wins the race type of driver. And my purse is constantly falling down, like first world problems, right? So I saw these and I was like, this was something that was in my save for later that I was like, oh, that's really cool. I'd love to have that for my car. So I finally just bought them when I saw that they were on sale. So these hooks will go on the back of each headrest and the kids can use it to hang their bags sometimes. Like we're gonna be going to the lake next weekend so they can hang their little, the girls will like pack little purses with their little toys and stuff like that. They can hang it on there and then I, when I'm in the car by myself, instead of putting my bag down where it can fall over, I'll just hang it on the hook and it'll be right there. Like just the little organizational things really get me sometimes. All right, in this box is a, actually this one shows you better, is a cosmetic mirror. So it is not put together. I have to like screw it in. So I'll just pop up the stock photo so you can see. But the one that I use right now when I'm putting my face on, as I, I like to say in the morning, is really old. The lights don't work anymore. I never really use the lights anyway. This one is not lit up. All I need is just a small mirror when I'm sitting at my vanity to see my face a little closer than the mirror that is like up. On, on my back and area, you know what I mean? So I did pick that up since I saw that it was on sale. All right, and then the last thing in this box, I'm gonna have to open this up after the fact um, to know which one it is, but I picked up two different ones. So here's the first one that I'm unboxing. This one, it, it's a cheese board and it includes a charcuterie cheese board, a fruit serving tray, a cheese board guide, and steel cutlery. These are so cool. And so I picked one up for myself, and then I picked one up for a gift at Christmas time for somebody. And I picked up two different ones, so I could open them up and see what they look like and see what I think, um, who I'm gifting it to, which one that person would like better. But I thought that they were you know, on decent sale, so I did go ahead and pick them up. They were so beautiful. This one is an all natural bamboo platter um, from Smurly, I think is how you say it. So again, I'll have, I'll look up which one this one is exactly and have that stock photo up for you guys to see. Okay, next box has two items in it. All right, so this kit, I'll put up the stock photo. I'm not sure if I'm gonna save this for the girl's birthday or if I'm gonna give it to them over the summer. I think this would be something fun for them over the summer. So this is a, it says just add water and fun a day. Um, 10 balloons, 150 large beads, and 30,000 small beads. They're like Orbeez. And it just says water beads, but it's a little kit for them to make their own like little scrunchie, put the beads in the balloons, tie them off, and they're like little stress balls or whatever. So I thought that they would really enjoy that. All right, in this box, is a set, I got some white dishes. I got several different um, sets of white items and these are little, I'm pretty sure, I feel like I read that they were oven safe but I'm gonna have to look that up because it doesn't tell on, on here. So these were, there's eight in here. It's a pack of eight and they're little ramekins but on the, on their like listing, their description it says like soy sauce bowls and whenever we're having any kind of Chinese dinner at home or like pot sticker stir fry anything like that Korean type meals uh, my kids love the soy sauce on the side especially when we're having like egg rolls they like to dip it and I thought these were just so cute normally I use my little um, like prep bowls for soy sauce but I saw these and I was like yep <laughs> I'm gonna get them again there's eight in there and they're just the perfect little size so I picked these up kitchen things get me that's for sure oh and this is gonna take a while so I got myself a drink this is just flavored water okay next box is actually some more white kitchen items that I got so this is a four piece of soup bowls now one thing that I started realizing really quick on Amazon uh, or at least for Prime Day, is you can't buy things in more than one quantity. At least it wouldn't let me. I could not figure it out. And I don't remember ever wanting to buy anything more than one last time. So I actually have another set of these soup bowls that I paid a different price somewhere because this is only a four set, this box right here, this Doen Balanced Life Full Excitement. So there's seven in here. I love that it has these. I feel like we don't have enough bowls and they're not like deep for soup. So I thought these were really nice. What size are these? Seven by seven by 2.75. And again, they have the handles on here. So I just love these. All right, other item that was in 
that box are measuring spoons. And let me go ahead and cut these. But I got these because they are a liquid and dry, which I thought was really cool. Normally, I don't pay much attention to that. I know there is a little bit of a difference in measuring liquid versus dry. So I thought these were really cool. And they have, I don't remember which one I don't have. One, one half. Oh, maybe I have all of these. Maybe I don't have the one eighth. I don't remember. I just love the look of these and they're magnetic. So storing them, obviously they're gonna stick together instead of being all scattered, which I really, really loved. So this is what they look like. So again, we've got the dry and the liquid and these come with one eighth, one fourth, one half. These are teaspoons, one teaspoon and then half a tablespoon and one tablespoon. All right, we've got a skinny box here. Oh, okay. And there's a couple items in this one. So this, again, I will pop up the stock photo so you can see it better. But this is another item that I've had saved for in my car. And this is like a little trash bag. I do not have a trash can or anything like that in my car. And with four kids, uh, my car is a disaster. Like I really need to clean it. But I don't have anywhere that I can just put trash. Like the kids just shove it in their little cup holders or they'll drop it on the ground, that kind of thing. So I'm hoping by having a designated spot, maybe every time they're like getting out of the car, I'll have them grab their trash and put it in here or be better about having them bring it in the house, we'll see. But most of the time their hands are like full of other things. So at least there'll be one spot in my car for them to put everything and it can be used for different things. Like it has little two, it has two little like bottle or cup holders on the side. Um, I think I can hang it from the headrest if I wanted to or just have it on the ground and like connected to my center console or something. But I did go ahead and pick that up to hopefully help with the mess in my car. And then these are two totally random things that I just saw that, that were on sale and definitely cheaper than what I pay at Target or Walmart or anything like that. So this is, these are two of the items that I use on my face. So I love this stuff. This is the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Corrector. Um, sometimes I'll buy like the under eye. I think it's called like under eye too. I use both of them. I feel like they do the same job. I got the ivory. The discount on Amazon Prime Day was definitely uh, cheaper than getting it in the store. And same with this. I don't use a foundation. I use like a BB cream or a tinted moisturizer instead of foundation. So I've used this brand before and I really like it. It's again, the Maybelline New York Maybelline Dream BB Fresh and I got it in the light medium. All right, this is definitely gonna be a long video. I'll try to edit out as much as possible, but I hope you guys have a snack and a drink because my camera has already shut off on me once. Okay, next box, I'll pop up the, po the picture because I'm not gonna open this just yet, but this is for my kitchen in my drawers. Which one is this? Because I have another one. Okay, so this is the knife block. I've had this saved for a while. I just never bit the bullet and bought it. So definitely seeing things on sale gets you to, like you're more enticed to buy things, right? That's what happened here. I had a lot of this stuff in my save for later and I, it enticed me. I'm like, oh, I'm saving this amount. That's what happened. So I did pick this up. I hope it fits. I feel like my drawers are a little smaller than normal or like, houses that are being built now the drawers are wider mine are not they're on the thinner side so i'm hoping that this will fit but the great thing about amazon is if any of this stuff doesn't end up working out or like the stuff that needs to fit a certain way if it doesn't fit i can return it and get my money back so i'm hoping that that fits because i like the idea of having the knives in there right now when I'm like reorganizing and stuff i'll probably share all of that on my vlog channel but i'll share what my kitchen drawers look like now and when i put that in there i'm hoping it, it'll work out this is actually not as big as i thought it was going to be so this is full of snacks it's called the premium care packages crave box handmade in the usa established in 2014. on the description it says 60 snacks this box just seems small for that but it has 60 different snacks i think there's like one or two of of each thing so let me go ahead and open this that just doesn't seem like 60, but maybe it is. I don't know. All right, here's what it looks like. I thought this would be great to take to the lake as like a snack box. With how small it is, it's already packed. I can keep it in here, close it, and take it to the lake. So here we go if it lasts for the lake. I need to hide it. Got some chocolate chips, some goldfish, animal crackers. What are these? Strawberry grams, Chex Mix, different kinds of popcorn. 
it's got like, okay, maybe it does have 60 things because look how little. Like they're little, just little snack size. Starburst, there's granola bars. I, auctioned, I, I got a big old box of granola bars too, just to stay stocked up, especially with, we're still in like deep into summer. The kids don't go back until the end of August, but I feel like it's definitely gonna be here before we know it. It's got some gummies in here, fun dip, actually a whole bunch of different stuff. Pringles, like individually wrapped Twizzlers. So I just, for the price, I thought it was really great. It says sold only on Amazon inside this box. But again, I thought this would just be something easy that's already packed. It's got a, a different variety in here to take to the lake. All right, next box had one thing in it. And oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. I'm gonna have to put up the stock photo on this one because I have to put this together. I'm just opening the box to see. Yeah, it's all in pieces, but this is a bread box, but it's it's see-through. Like you can see what's in it, which I think is really cool. I have a bread box that I picked up from Hobby Lobby a couple years ago. I'm actually using it for packets. Like whenever we go somewhere, like through a drive-through or have food delivered, and you get like those soy sauce packets or ketchup, mayo, different kinds of like ranch, barbecue sauce, that kind of thing. That is what my bread box is being used. I'm looking at it right now. <laughs> that is what I have in my bread box right now. And I have it turned around so it doesn't say bread. It's just white. And this one I just think looks so pretty and it's hopefully it'll look good out on my counter, but I think it'll look really good with like muffins that I'm baking for the kids for, for the morning or fresh baked bread, that kind of thing. I'm, I'm really excited about that. This box has several things in it. These are glass straws. I am slowly replacing our plastic straws because my younger kids still like will chew on it. So they don't look the best, especially when we have people over and they wanna use straws. So whenever I see glass straws, that's what I've been um, picking up. So these ones are clear black and white. It's just a six pack, so I'll be able to get rid of six plastic ones. And I'll have these ones, and my kids can try to chew on these, but I don't think they would. I hope they're smart enough to know not to chew on glass, so I won't have those little teeth marks in the top of my straws. But my younger three, actually my oldest does too, because she, especially in her cold brew, but they use straws for everything. I mean, it doesn't even matter what they're drinking. Water, orange juice, milk, they grab a straw and put it in their cup. All right, another kitchen item. I don't need to take this out because you can clearly see what it is. This is a strainer that attaches to your pot, which I just think is the coolest thing. I've never owned one of these, but that will make it a little easier for the pasta dishes instead of having to pull out my strainer, something bigger. This one's just smaller. It'll fit in the dishwasher better. So I just thought, it's it's like the accessories, right? I, I don't always say that word wrong, but whatever. This just clips on and the little accessories get me every time. I just, I'm, I'm a huge fan of kitchen items. Okay, this is another box that I'm not going to open, but I will pop up the stock photo. This is something that we picked up for our kids for Christmas. So originally I had saved, I had like a little Pinterest board for outdoor ideas. And one of them shows like the rock climbing items stuck to the side of a house. And we do have a little bit of a slab in the back, but I feel like we're going to, we're not going to attach it to the house. I think we're gonna make like something wood for them to climb on. I don't know, they're just climbers, they love that. They're getting into that age where like a swing set, they're, they've outgrown their swing set. They like the trampoline. We are hoping to get a pool next year. We're really excited about that. So depending on um, what we do end up wanting to do with that, it'll either be like a Christmas present or if we want to attach it to the pool, then we'll just save it for next summer. But again, it's just the, when I see like, oh, you're gonna save this amount, it gets me, it gets me. I definitely um, like to shop, but if you guys have been with me for any amount of time, you know that. All right, I'm gonna open, I'm going to open this box because it is more bold. I feel like that's definitely what we don't have enough of. I, I guess the stuff that I cook and like salads and stuff, my kids don't like to have their salads like touching their dinner. So we use a lot of bowls. Okay, so this one, this is when I realized I couldn't buy things in quantities. So the first set of bowls, these ones look a little smaller, but they'll still work. I, I still think they're cute. So this is the other set. When I saw that I couldn't buy two of that first set, 
I went looking and searching to see if I could find another one because I wanted at least six. And since these are in sets of four, eight is perfect because we are a family of six. So I did go ahead and get another one. This is Smee's. I don't know. It does say oven safe, microwave, dishwasher safe, lead free. So again, I just love the little handles because sometimes when you're, you know, if you're putting something hot in the bowl and taking it to the table, this gets hot, you know, and sometimes my kids are like, mommy, can you carry my bowl to the table? So I thought that the handles would just be something nice and extra and these should not get hot. Like the, the heat should be right here where the food is, right? So they can carry their bowls like this. All right, next box. I picked myself up some new slippers. Puppies. I mean, puppies. Um, they chew and the slippers that I normally wear that look like this are gonna need to be thrown away. Um, also, my husband needs some new slippers, but he likes to pick out his own. So I didn't pick any up for him, but I did tell him that Amazon has, I mean, a, a huge selection. So these are the ones that I went for. I thought they were really cute. They um, have them, they had them in a couple different colors, but I picked the blue. So my, the ones that I'm gonna have to trash are gray, but I just, I definitely uh, love blue. It is one of my favorite colors. So I picked these up to replace the ones that are chewed on. All right, one, this was like a last minute addition. I didn't even think to look at school supplies, but they had, at the very end, they had a ton of stuff. This was the only thing I ended up putting in my cart because at that point I was overwhelmed with everything that I had. But this glue I felt like was a great deal. I think it was a total of like five bucks. There's 30 sticks in here. And with three kids going back to school next year, um, you know, glue is always on that school supply list. And then I like to donate extras for the teachers to have in their classroom. So I thought 30 was a great amount. So I did pick up this 30 pack of the Elmer's washable all purpose school glue sticks. Okay, this is something that I will pop up the stock photo because I'm not going to open it, but I picked this up for my son Bryce. I think we're gonna save this for Christmas. They had a like a rock tumbler kit, but I wanna kinda I wanna pick his brain a little bit without him knowing that I want to buy that for him and see if that's something that he would enjoy. This is a rock mineral and fossil activity kit. He liked collecting rocks and, and minerals and that kind of thing, like the little gemstones. So this one has a bunch in it. I can't remember how many, but it does come with a bunch. This is a, a fairly heavy and it's by National Geographic. So I picked that up for him and the rock tumbler kit might be something else that we pick up later on, but they did have it on Amazon Prime Day. I just I wasn't sure if that would be something he was into. I know he likes collecting the gemstones, but he's not really into, not not like this is like arts and crafts, but he's not into as many hands-on activities like that anymore, but he likes to collect the gemstones and read about them and that kind of thing. So I know he'll like that kit. More, oh, this bubble wrap is not as easy to pop. Oh, that's not as satisfying. The ones that are like super easy to pop, very satisfying. That's totally why poppets are so nice for kids right now or popular. Reminds them of bubble wrap probably. All right, this box has another set of bowls. Like I said, I'm replacing all of my bowls. I'm getting rid of like the little kitty bowls that I have and just upgrading. My kids are, uh, I have an almost 17 year old and then the twins are going to be nine this year and then my son Bryce is 10. He turned 10 in January. So this, oh, this one is not, bowls like for cereal or anything these are two serving bowls which i absolutely love so what got me is on their little description it said perfect for like pasta dishes which is one of my family's favorite and we have some kind of pasta dish probably about once a week and i thought this would be nice to put it in here to serve most of the time it's like assembly line in my kitchen my kids just make their plates or i help them sometimes depending on what we're having but i would really like to occasionally have everything just out at the table so we are like sitting there longer together because most of the time the kids Kids make their plates or I make them they sit down start eating and they're halfway done by the time especially right now with extra dogs and stuff in the house it's we do not eat together as often as we used to speaking of dogs our last foster pup is upstairs Oliver and he's whiny like he wants to be down here with me but he's chewing so my kids have him he wants to be here with me but he can't all right so I did get this was a two set I don't know if I said that but 
I thought that was great. I could maybe make like a smaller salad and then pasta and have these both out on the table, but I just love that. Oh, and I will, so I'm opening up the next box. I will have all of these items that I picked up. No idea if they're still on sale, but I will have them all linked in my Amazon store that's in the description box. Okay, so these bowls I actually want to replace. So I have a lot of little um, like prep bowls that I use in videos sometimes. And like when the kids are getting certain snacks, they go for like these smaller bowls. And I have just a whole lot of mishmash ones. And I'm just trying to get a little bit more clean and organized in my cabinets. So I'm going to replace the ones that I have with these ones, which like I said, are just like the small little prep bowls or sometimes the kids will have um, like cereal as a snack with no milk, that kind of thing. So like I said, like snack wise and that kind of thing, I thought these would be perfect. It's the same brand as some of the other ones, the Doen, and it's just that white cream a little bit, not stark white, but more like creamy white, off white color. And I think this is a set of six or eight. This is a set of six and it tells me 10 ounces if you guys wanted to know the size. And then also in this box is a, another kitchen organizer. This one's a bamboo drawer organizer and you can like pull it. This is the one that I'm afraid won't fit in my cabinet, so we'll see. But I wanted to grab it while it was on sale just to try it out. And if it doesn't, not the end of the world, I can just return it. But bamboo kitchen drawer organizer, I'll pop up a picture. This one comes with scissors and a peeler and also a 12 month warranty, money back guarantee. So I did pick that up and I said expandable, right? Yeah, expandable silverware, or really you can use it for whatever. Any kind of, like it comes with scissors and a peeler, that kind of thing, like your extra utensils and stuff, you could use these for as well. What is in this box? It does not tell me, just has the brand name and I definitely don't remember the brand of everything that I bought. I feel like this is something also that my daughter Paige, oh yes, okay. So my oldest daughter Paige requested the big hair clip. So her hair is very similar to mine. She's got it, it's longer than shoulder length and it's very thin. Her and I have very thin hair and my daughter Rose. Two kids have my hair and two kids have my husband's hair. Bryce and Pearl have very thick hair. So Paige wanted something to hold all of it up. And she asked for like the big clips and I don't have any of these. So they, they had several different varieties and colors and I think some of them even had prints on them. I just went with the basic colors. I thought she would enjoy these the most. So here's the size of these clips, basically as long as my hand. So hopefully she likes these. I'm just gonna put these with her little, like a birthday basket and give that to her. The last thing in this big box are is the hardware that we are putting on our cabinets. So I've gotten a lot of questions, mainly over on the vlog channel, because that's where I share mostly about our kitchen renovation, but it was actually, um, we're getting a completely new island, and we're turning it, it's gonna look different, our floor is gonna be a little bit um, jacked up for a while as they're replacing everything, but the company that's making the cabinets for our island is a little bit backed up. So we've been waiting a little longer than we thought, but that's okay. Once the kitchen's done, it's gonna be fantastic. So they're actually not going to start until after we get back from our vacation, which is mid to late July. So um, that's when everything's gonna start and I'll be able to share more with you guys, but we are going this Friday to pick out our countertop and our backsplash. That way everything is ready for when the um, custom island comes in or when it's done being built. So I did see the um, knobs, or actually they're all handles, on Amazon on sale. So I went ahead and scored them. We did get a little bit more than we wanted. I think this is a 55 pack, but um, our next step to our kitchen is we're actually adding a built-in, some more built-in cabinets on the other side, which I'll share all of that on the vlog channel in our little breakfast area. So I'm hoping that this is enough, otherwise we can go back on. They have, and they're black, so they'll, they'll be good. But I'm really excited that we have another item waiting for our kitchen on hand. These big ones have like the heavy stuff in it, that is for sure. This one, I will pop up a picture because I'm not gonna open it just yet. But I picked up a new runner for my dining room table. Since I am drawn towards the creams and all of that, obviously they get stained if the kids spill stuff. So the one that I have on there has a couple stain marks that I just cannot get out. Plus, I feel like it's too much 
it's just too much for my table. I think I shared that video on this channel, so I will link it if you guys wanna check out the dining room makeover, but the runner that I have on there is a little too busy for me, plus it has like one or two little stain marks on the cream. Can you guys hear Oliver? He wants to come down. I'm gonna to have to let him come down and play in these boxes while I finish up, but, and he's not alone. My kids are with him, but he's, he's a little attached to me. So anyway, I'll pop up a picture so you guys can see what this one looks like. Hi buddy, do you hear me talking? I'm trying to make a video. Did you miss me? Another kitchen item, can you see it? Oh yeah, here's better this way. So this is um, just something extra to have. So on my KitchenAid, I recently made some cookies and really anytime I'm using it, when I'm putting flour in it, a little bit gets spilt, not the end of the world, but that's why they come up with these really cool items that you can use. So this is a pouring chute that just fits on your bowl in your KitchenAid. I'm sure you could use this on other items as well. Maybe the Instant Pot bowl. I don't know, any type of bowl, but I bought it for my KitchenAid. So when I'm pouring the dry items or liquid items in there, it makes it a little easier and there's less cleanup. Yes, you have one more item that you have to wash, but hey, that's all right. I just like washing dishes, but I just like cleaning up messes too. So you kind of got to pick which one you dislike the most, right? So I did pick that up. All right, now we're getting into two things that my kids, my girls, maybe my son a little bit have been like waiting for. They know that I ordered these. I was gonna keep one of them for the girl's birthday, but I'm just gonna give them both to them now. And that is two different sets of like assortment of fidget items. So the first assortment comes in this little bag and I don't remember what is all in here, so I'll pop up that stock photo that you can see. And I don't remember how many items does it tell me. It does not. It just says sensory toys, stress, anxiety, and again, it's a variety pack. So this is one of those packs. And this is the other set that I picked up. So this one came in a box, not a bag. And this one on the back says fidget, fidget toy sets for the classroom or office. So again, I just picked up two different ones because they have really been into these. I don't know how many are in here either. Let me see if I can. Oh, so these ones are not all wrapped up. So we've got, like I said, a variety. They're just so weird. I'm, I'm not into this kind of thing, but apparently it's really popular. These little snake guys, there's one of these that they're gonna have to pull apart because it's like really stuck together. These little popping peas, I, I don't get it, but they really love them. All right, this is an item that's been in my save for later forever because I went back and forth. This is so cool. I think the kids will enjoy it, but I originally wanted to keep it on the back of the house, but we have dogs and I'm afraid that having, like enticing the birds with bird feed that they will the dogs will get them, you know? The birds are gonna have a short life. So I haven't purchased it, but I think I'm gonna put it on the front of the house. Um, my office is towards the front of the house and there's a big window in there. So that would be really cool too for when I'm in there editing or whatever, watching the birds eat. I think that would be cute. So that I you know, saw that it was on sale and I was like, you know what? It's been in my save for later for way too long. We're gonna go ahead and get it and we'll just put it on the front of the house. So this is a per bird's eye view window bird feeder. So it's completely see-through. It attaches to the window. I've got my kids taking this stuff because the dogs are down here now. <laughs> they're, they're putting it all on the tables so the puppies can't chew on anything. But um, this is gonna be really cool. I do need to pick up some bird feed though. So it just says sliding seed tray with bird safe air circulation system. They did have several different varieties. I just went with the more classic birdhouse look. I'm not sure. I need to check and see how much these guys cost at Sam's and Costco when they're on sale. However, I am completely out. I use these maybe once or twice a week in my coffee as like a breakfast um, replacement. And I'll go ahead and open this box. It's Premier Protein. And this flavor is definitely my favorite because I love the flavor of coffee. I think this is a 12 pack. I think they are in what, an 18 pack? 
It's been a little while since I've purchased them at Costco or Sam's. Um, these look a little different too. They're more bottles than like the cardboard, but this is the Cafe Latte and it is 11.5 ounces. So they do go on sale like seven or $8 off. So I'm not quite sure if this was the better bang for my buck, getting them on Prime Day when they were on sale for 12, but I am completely out and I'm not going to Costco or Sam's for another week or two. I think we're gonna wait until after we get back from the lake to do any kind of bulk shopping. So I did go ahead and opt to pick those up. All right, two boxes left. This box has something big in it for Paige, but we'll start with the little things first. My daughter Paige has been asking for, anytime I'm going to the store, she's asked me to look for a tongue scraper. I just brush my tongue with my toothbrush, but I guess she read that tongue scrapers work really good. And I saw this four pack on sale on Prime Day. So I went ahead and picked it up. We will try it. I'll let her pick what color she wants and then maybe my husband and I will have one. I'm not gonna let my younger kids have one. I feel like this is something that they'll mess around with, they don't understand what it's for, that kind of thing, so we'll just hold on to the fourth one, but I did see that it was a four pack, so I went ahead and I picked these up. I like the different colors too, and that they come with a case. All right, here's the other set of doll clothes. So this is a 20 pack, and it just says underwear, hair clip, doll clothes. It's just a variety, it's got all sorts of stuff, so I'll pop up the picture. So you can see what's in there. Again, it's in a resealable pouch, but my kids will probably keep this in other things, not this pouch. This is something that I did pick up for Paige for her birthday. She likes cold brew coffees and she likes tea. And this tea set is so cool. So these are, it says Blooming Tea Garden, an exquisitely curated collection of blooming teas. So these are the ones that, like a flower blooms in your pot. It says heat fresh water to a boil, Place one tea flower in a durable glass, bless you, cover with hot water, and then steep until the leaves have opened fully, swirl tea to balance flavors, enjoy, and there's like a little flower in your teacup. I thought that was so cute. All right, so this is an item that she asked for for her birthday. The dogs are like all around me now. And that is a portable mini refrigerator for her bathroom for like her skincare and her face stuff, her face masks, that kind of thing. So I saw that they had one on Amazon Prime for sale. So I scooped it up since this was like the main, one of the main things that she asked for for her birthday. This video is a little crazy. I just had to wrestle with a puppy on bubble wrap and stuff. <sighs> okay, but he's back up. He's just gonna have to deal with missing me for a little bit. Uh, here is the other <laughs> cheese board that I got. So it, I think it com comes with the same stuff. On the back it says charcuterie cheese board, fruit serving tray, cheese board guide, and steel cutlery. But this one looks a little different. There's little differences between the two that I picked out. So I did, again, get two. One for me and then one for a Christmas gift. <sighs> okay, last a big box. All right, here's something else that I got for the girls. They have been loving to make jewelry and I saw this ABC kit so they could like make their own name or make bracelets that say like best friends forever, that kind of thing. So I did pick this up and not just bracelets, they can make necklaces as well. It says create over 40 jewelry designs, includes 1100 charms and beads and everything you need. It's got like charms, beads, star beads. It tells you everything. It's got cords in here. So I picked that up for Rose and Pearl to share. I didn't realize how bad I just got scratched trying to get that bubble wrap from the puppy. So if you guys have seen my hands in cooking videos and you're like, what are you doing? You look so abused. It's, I mean, I am being abused, but by puppies who aren't trying to hurt me, they're just overly playful. All right, so these in this box is a set of six, I believe, and these are like individual little um, dinner bowls, like pasta bowls, salad. They're a little bigger than I thought they were going to be, but I think this would be great to help with portion control. Um, specifically for my husband and I when we're having pasta because that's definitely one of our favorites. So instead of getting like a dinner plate, maybe this would help having like pasta and salad in here. I don't know. But um, these are definitely a little bigger than I thought. So I'm gonna have to think about these if we would actually use them, but they're beautiful. These are YHY fine porcelain dishwasher oven and microwave safe. So 
Again, it was a set of six in that color that I'm replacing everything with. I just love the look of these. And told you I got granola bars. I went ahead and picked up this. I thought it was great. So these are, how many are in here? I think it was what, like 40, 58, 58 granola bars. These are perfect for back to school. I'm not even gonna open these up. I'm gonna put these in the back of my pantry so I have them. These are perfect for the kids take one to two snacks to school and also like perfect to just add in as a little sweetness to their lunch box so this is the 25 percent less sugar there's 22 chocolate chip 22 peanut butter chocolate chip and then 14 cookies and cream all right and then this i'll have to pop up a picture but these are floating shelves that i got for the half bathroom another room in the house that we are going to be redoing this year some rooms are going to have to wait until next year but this year we're redoing a few key rooms in our house and the half bathroom is one of them or our gas bath as i like to call it it's just got a toilet and a sink so i got some floating shelves to go in there and i've had my eye on these these have been in my save for later for a while as well so i went ahead and snagged them up when i saw that there was you know a little bit off of the price all right, so that is my Amazon Prime Day haul. I hope you guys got a few ideas from this, whether it's just items that you're looking to replace in your home or a few gift ideas or just items that you've had your eye on. Um, maybe some of this stuff will still be on sale. Again, I'll have all of it linked in my storefront that is in the description box. Give this video a big thumbs up if you like when I share more of these like chatty sit down haul. I have been sharing a lot of food content here lately because that's just been easier for me to do with a house full during the summer. But I hope you guys are having a fantastic day and I will see you in the next video. Bye.